What's good with YouTube? It is your boy Vaughn, and as you guys can see by the title, we are back with a new video for you guys today. And in this one, we're gonna be reacting to the brand new SML movie, Who Built the Pyramids? This literally just dropped one minute ago. I got the notification. We finna dive right into this. You guys know these are always bangers. The original video will be in the description down below. As always, if you guys would like to follow me on my social media links, I would greatly appreciate it. And without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and dive right into this. Let's get it. Hey, Joseph, you want to watch the new episode of Dr. Finkelschitz? Heck yeah, dude. <laughs> hey, guys, what? I just got a giant red lobster as a sign holder. Shut up, Cody. We're trying to watch the new episode of Dr. Finkelschitz. Oh, I guess we're not going to watch today. Hello, I am Dr. Friedrich Finkelschitz, and today I will tell you how the aliens built the pyramids. Now, originally, everybody thought that the pyramids were built by the Egyptians, but no, this is a load of caca, and I will tell you why. You see, there are <laughs> 2.3 million stones inside the Great Pyramid of Giza, and each stone weighs between two and 80 tons. Now that means they had to place 212 stones a day for 30 years with no breaks. Now, how is this possible? How could a human lift a stone that is heavier than an elephant? Now, a scientist would tell you they used cranes. Hmm, interesting. Well, let's take a look. This is a crane. Do you really think <laughs> that this stupid... <laughs> Ain't no way. Bird could lift 80 tons with these little toothpick legs? I don't think so. And how would you even tell it to do that? Look at his stupid bird eyes. You can't tell him what to do. He's a bird. He's stupid. No, that is impossible. <laughs> I will tell you how they did it. Aliens. That is how the aliens came down in their UFOs like... Bew, bew, and they picked up the stones and they placed the stones on top of the pyramid just like this. And they built the pyramid at exactly... 29.9792458 degrees north, which just so happens to be the exact same number as the speed of light, which is... I, I really wonder how, like, Junior and Jeffy and all them are going to be taking this in. Like, how, what, I wonder what their thought process is right now. I have belief that this stuff really happened, but that's just me. Everybody is different. the secret to time travel. The aliens were trying to teach us how to travel through time. And if they would just let me inside the tomb of the pyramid to talk to King Dad's mummy, I could figure out time travel. But no, Dr. Finkelschitz, you're not allowed in there anymore. You kiss the mummies too much. Whoa, I never knew aliens <laughs> built the pyramids. No, dude, I thought slaves did. No, Joseph, slavery only happened. Oh my in God, Joseph, chill. America. Oh yeah, you right, you right. Guys, aliens did not build the pyramids. Yes, they did, Cody. Dr. Finkel should just explained it. Well, he's wrong. He's a kook. Okay, Cody, then how did a human lift up a stone that yeah, weighed Cody. two tons? Yeah, they yeah. used ramps? Cody, you're telling me they use skateboard ramps? Tony Hawk wasn't invented until like 40 years ago. What, invented? Don't you mean born? Tony Hawk's a real person? Yes. What? Really? Oh, man. He fooled us all along. I thought he was a video game character. What? No, he's a real person. <laughs> he can really do a 360 Vera McTwist? Yeah. In real life? Yeah, that's why they made video games about him. Well, if the Egyptians had Tony Hawk <laughs> and his ramps, then they probably did build the pyramids. Well, he wasn't around back then. Then it had to be aliens. What? No, it was hundreds of thousands of Egyptians all working together. <laughs> Slavery. Wait, Cody, why would <laughs> a lobster costume? Well, I I thought we were gonna do SML movie. Cody gets a job at Red Lobster today. No, that's next week. Oh, well, I'll just take this off then. I look like I'm gonna keep my eyes off for that one. <laughs> Cody gets a job at Red Lobster. I can't wait. <laughs> anyway. Okay, I'm back. Now, where were we? Oh, yeah, the aliens did not build the pyramids and neither did Tony Hawk. Cody, then how did the Egyptians build the pyramids? They had no technology, no tools. All they had was sand. Well, they also had 30 years, Junior. Okay, Cody, I'll give you 30 years to build a pyramid. Go. Well, I didn't say I could do it. Well, no, all they had was sand. You have all the technology in the world, Cody. Go. Well, they also had hundreds of thousands of Egyptians. So if I clone you 100,000 times, you could build a pyramid? Well, I wouldn't know how. Okay, I'll even give you Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 4 for the PlayStation 2. There's your ramp. <laughs> the zoo level. Oh, and you can play as Django Fett. Okay, deal. I mean, you're not going to get a pyramid, but I'm going to have a good time. Wait, why are we even arguing about this? Why don't we just ask God who built the pyramids? Oh, yeah, we do know. Yeah, Junior, because hey, you can just can do that. Down here? Hey, guys. What's oh, up? my God. They made it happen. Oh, hey, God. Hey, sorry. I just got out of the shower. Wait, there's showers in heaven? Yeah. Well, I mean, there's one in my house. And believe it or not, the hot water still runs out. <laughs> I mean, the pipes run all the way down from hell. And you know how people say when hell freezes over? Well, apparently it does because my water gets pretty cold. But whenever that happens, I just hold my mouth up to the shower head and turn the water into wine. <laughs> it's five o'clock somewhere, right? Well, me and my friends were arguing <laughs> because we don't want to know who built the pyramids. I think it was aliens, but Cody thinks it was the Egyptians and Tony Hawk. I never said Tony Hawk. Well, actually, Tony Hawk's not a bad guess. This one time I teleported Tony Hawk back to Egypt time so he could skateboard down the side of the pyramid. It was pretty sick. But no, Egyptians and aliens and Tony Hawk did not build the pyramids. Then who built the pyramids? Um, 
Nobody's recording us, right? No. Okay. Well, I've never told anybody this, but here's what happened. So I was sitting on my couch, and I was bored. <laughs> I was just playing Tetris on my phone. I actually had the iPhone way before anyone else did, because, you know, I'm God. So I looked over at Earth and said, oh, it's kind of boring over there. So I walked over to the Earth, and I changed the setting. <laughs> Imagine the guys just walking through space like that. That's crazy. Into creative mode. And then I went down to Egypt because it was mostly just flat and sandy. And I started placing blocks <laughs> and building pyramids. Kind of just screwing around, honestly. And then I went over to Stonehenge, too. And I built that and kind of just stacking stuff, you know. And then I went to the snowy area, right? And then I built a bunch of blocks as high as I could go until I reached the height limit. And I called it Fort God. But then you people called it Mount Everest, which is kind of lame if you ask me. I like my name a lot better. And then I went and killed the Ender Dragon, so that was fun. And then the Mayans hopped on my server, and they started building pyramids and shit in Mexico. And I was like, guys, you're totally taking my idea. So I was so mad, I punched the earth as hard as I could, and I created the Grand Canyon. So I turned it back to survival mode <laughs> oh and flooded the earth. But not before I told this one villager named Noah to make a boat, and I told him to put two of every animal on it, because I really did not feel like making all those animals again. And I gave him <laughs> Creative mode powers to build the boat, obviously. And then I just went back to my couch. <laughs> imagine if this is a story that this whole time. Imagine if this is the story, bro. Oh my gosh. Whoa. The well, world would be the in shambles. Creative mode so we can build something? Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, no way. Absolutely not. The Mayans ruined that for everyone, so you can thank them. Thank you, Mayans. Anyway, I gotta go. I gotta go convince Tom Brady to come back, but it's gonna take a miracle. I'm gonna have to part the seas or some shit. I'll just walk. Yeah, because Aaron Rodgers did get hurt. Recorded man. the whole thing. <laughs> Joseph, you weren't supposed to record it. Yeah, God said not to. Dude, this is a one in a billion opportunity, and I'm gonna get rich off of it. I'm gonna sell this to the news. Well, no, no, Joseph. Ugh. Do you really think he's gonna sell it to the news? <laughs> Junior, look. The news. The news. Yeah. <laughs> Breaking news, okay? There is shocking video evidence of God admitting to flooding the earth just because he was bored. There are currently <laughs> riots happening all around the world. Oh, wow. Yeah, oh, man. Y'all yeah, gotta chill because Jesus is really gonna get in your head. Who cares for this guy? I got $20,000 off that God video. They only gave you $20,000 for the only video evidence that God's real. I'm right. Gonna bargain with them. Hey! Oh, God! Oh, no! God damn. That's right! That's <laughs> yeah. You weren't supposed to record me! Look, I was broke, God! I need some cash! Break bread with a nigga! Well, what are you gonna do with all that cash? <laughs> He just so got break bread with a nigga, bro. <laughs> the fuck up, bro. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, man. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. The humor in this shit is funny as hell. That's right. Yeah, he said, "God damn, right from the God, chill." Me. Look, I was broke. God, I need some cash. Break, break bread, bread with a nigga. Well, what are you gonna do with all that cash when the world is flooded? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, yo, chill. Oh, no. Junior and Cody, look, if y'all ruined it for all of us, bro. <laughs> Imagine this is real. Wait, guys, what happened? Junior, God flooded the entire earth, and it's Joseph's fault. Dude, I just wanted some money, God. Yeah, well, what good is that money if the whole world is flooded? Help! Help! Junior, no one's coming to help. The whole world is flooded. Help! Ugh. Kids, kids, thank God you have this floating couch. Do you know what happened? <laughs> They're on the couch in the ocean, bro. What? I can't swim, so I wouldn't do this. Just say sorry, this wave's coming. I'm sorry, God. I think everything's back to normal. I think the world's not flooded anymore. Wait, kids, can you explain what happened again? No, that's why you don't mess with the wrath of God. Next time you're getting a meteor. I've started over once and I'll do it again. What do you think happened to the dinosaurs? That's why you don't cheat at Connect Four. Wait, wait, so you're telling me- He said the dinosaurs cheated at Connect Four, so that's why he sent the meteors, too. God flooded the entire Chill. earth because he was mad at your friend? Well, d you do know you killed, like, millions of people, right? Yeah. Yeah, and I think you took my money, too, my $20,000. It's in the water. Yeah, and that's theft, so I, I think I have to arrest you. What? Y yeah, I, I think you're under arrest. P put your hands behind your back. We're going to court. Order, 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 order. I am the Honorable Judge Boback, and today we will be hearing the case of God versus Earth. As you can see, our <laughs> old courtroom got flooded, so I had to set up this crappy one, which is extra annoying because the old one was made of wood, so water damage is going to be a bitch. I mean, termites out the ass, and the floorboards are going to be all <laughs> squishy. Ugh. 
oh, and my gavel got wet, so I have to use an actual mallet now. Yeah, so, oh, also, my 1967 Volkswagen Beetle was totaled, and that was all original parts, so I don't know how insurance is going to cover that shit. But anyway, God, what was your plan? What was God's plan? Are we chalking this up to mysterious? <laughs> what was God's plan? Well, Your Honor, a video of me was sold to the news without my permission, and that video was supposed to remain private. I mean, he never told me specifically not to record. I specifically asked if anyone was recording, and they said no! There was nobody recording at the time. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. It doesn't matter if he recorded the video or not. It doesn't give you the right to flood the earth and kill... What is the body count now? Three billion people? Mm -hmm. I didn't know that many people didn't know how to swim for 30 seconds. Counterpoint? <laughs> 30 seconds? Damn! I'm God, so I can do whatever I want. I can't mm. swim for 30 yes, seconds myself. That is true. You could just turn me into a toad or a pillar of salt or paprika or something. There's really nothing keeping you here. How about we just say it was an act of God and we can call it square. Is that good? Well, you see, the first time you flooded the earth, America wasn't like a thing, so there were no laws against it. But now there are, and mass murder is very illegal. So, I sentence you to three billion life sentences. Uh, all right, I'm tired of playing with you guys. I'm going home. Bailiff, stop him! He's God, what do you want me to do? Even if we put him in chains, he can still get away. Oh, well, <laughs> I guess I must repent then. I'm sorry, God, for trying to put you in jail. <laughs> My bad. Hey! <laughs> what about my $20,000? Well, guys, today was weird. Dude, I lost $20,000. You were never supposed to have it to begin with. Wait, I got a question. That part. Guys. So when God flooded the earth, it destroyed my house. And then when Joseph said sorry, we all came back and my house is fine. But three billion people still drowned. Does that mean your house is destroyed, Cody? Oh, shit. I got to go check on my parents. I don't have parents. So I'm going to just chill here. Wait, Cody, before you leave. <laughs> so you said that the Egyptians built the I ain't going to lie. Place. It's weird so not I seeing Jeffy in the episode. Got a challenge for you. This is the first time. So look, here's a great And I've seen Jeffy not in that episode. Set. So I'm gonna give you 30 minutes to build this because the real Egyptians only had 30 years to build it and they weighed tons and tons. These are little Lego pieces. So you have 30 minutes to build it. And if you don't build it, we get to stomp on your glasses. <sighs> oh damn. I'm gonna go home and play Tony Hawk Pro Skater 4, but my house was probably destroyed. So I guess I'll do this. Yeah. <laughs> You're not even open them. You're just burying your face in them. Are you guys gonna like help at all? No, it's only you. Uh, nerd out. We need some lamps. <laughs> Not gonna lie, it was different seeing an episode of SML without Jeffy in it. But this episode was very funny, bro. The way they were, he said break bad. Joseph said break bad bread with a nigga to God, bro. Like chill. <laughs> they said God did. And then the judge trying to repent for his sin after trying to send him to jail. This was a funny episode, bro. I'm not gonna lie. As always, the original video will be in the description down below if you guys would like to see it without me talking over or reacting. And while you were down there, if you would like to follow my social media links, I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. And I will see you guys in the next one. We are out. Peace.